Hey, how's it going? Today I'll show you how to get the VooPlayer application to your Fire Stick or Android TV. The whole process is super easy and will take you only a couple of minutes. First of all, you will have to get an app called Unloader. You can actually get it for free from the official Amazon App Store. To do so, we we'll go to search on our device and here in the search bar, start typing the loader. And as you can see, the loader has already popped out for us at the bottom. So we click on it, and that's the app which you need to get to your device. But after you get the loader, it's not over yet. We still have to set it up. So in order to set up the loader, we gotta. So in order to set up the loader, we gotta go to the settings. Here they are. Open them. Then scroll down and go to My Far TV. Open it. Here we'll have to turn on the developer options on your device. But on some Fire Sticks, and especially on the new Fire Stick devices, the developer options can be hidden by default. So if that's the case, and you cannot find developer options anywhere, no need to worry, it's actually easy to make them appear. Just go to About, select Fire TV Stick, and now you have to click on the middle button on your remote for 7 times, and do it fast. So let's do it. As you can see, now at the bottom for me it says no need, you are already a developer. That's in my case. And in your case, it's going to say that you have become a developer now. So if you go back a bit, you will finally see developer options, which have appeared right here. So open them, make sure to enable ADB debugging, then go to install unknown apps. From here you have to locate the loader and turn that option on. So what it does? It's going to allow you to install other applications from the internet and not necessarily only those which are only available in the official Amazon App Store by default. And that's exactly what we're going to do right now. So now, finally, let's go to the list of apps on your device, which right here, open it, and here you'll find the loader, which is set up and ready to use on your device. But before actually using the loader, there's one more thing which you always recommend doing. It's of course connecting to a VPN. In my case, I mostly use NordVPN. Because they're super fast, they got a great app for Fire Sticks, Android TVs, phones, laptops, or pretty much any other device you may use. And they are not expensive for such a premium service. In fact, they cost less than a cup of coffee per month, which is great pricing for us, the users. In a VPN app, you just connect to any server. Let's say I will connect to Germany right now, and from the moment you connect, all your traffic is going to be totally encrypted. It means no one can track you or snoop on you online. And that's really important if you want to stay out of trouble. And if you don't have a VPN yet, but you want to try it out, I do have a great offer for you. If you use my link, which will be in a pinned comment below the video or in the description of the video, you'll get three months of NordVPN totally for free, which is an amazing offer. And if you're watching this video on your TV or on your Fire Stick, then just grab your phone or your computer, open up a web browser and go to topvpnoffer.com. That's my website, which is going to give you the same amazing deal for NordVPN, with 3 months for free. Or just scan the QR code, which you can see on the screen right now with a camera of your phone. It works the same way and it's also going to give you the same deal for NordVPN. And now finally, let's use the loader safely. So I need to go to the list of apps on your device, open it, then go and open the loader. Here on the left side menu, make sure to click on home and not on browser. So once again, make sure that you have clicked on home, that's very important. And then here in that search bar, we'll need to enter a code. The code is going to be 3, 2, 7, 1, 8, 7. So once again, the code is 327187, that's the code that you have to enter, and then you need to click on go. And while it's loading, make sure to subscribe my channel so you would get even more content about Fire Sticks, as well as please hit the like button below this video. It surely helps me a lot, and this way I'll be able to create even more videos for you. And now the download should have started for us, but it seems that some error has occurred, so let's just click on that code again and enter the code again. So just hit on go. And now it seems that everything works fine. 
so that probably was just a bug. As you can see, the download is happening. Now there should appear a button, yep, so there is a button to install the app. Let's click on it and wait until the boot player application gets installed to our device. After that, don't click on open yet, instead press on done, because this way we'll be able to delete the installation files, as we don't need them anymore on our device. So we click on done and then delete and delete. This way we save yourself some free space in your Fire Stick. And that's really important, because by default you don't have too much of free space on your device anyway. Now finally let's go to the list of apps on your device, which is right here, open it, then scroll down and here at the bottom you'll find Foo Player, which we just unloaded. Now I would recommend you to click on the options button on your remote, that's the button with three horizontal lines. Click on it and then press on move to front. This way Woo Player is always going to be at the very top of your application list and therefore it's going to be super easy for you to access the app every time you need it. Just don't forget to keep the VPN connected to stay safe and out of trouble. Enjoy and see you next time. Bye bye.